Today we're attempting to recreate the look of the $3,000 Samsung Frame TV, but for $75. Once we found a molding we liked, I measured the TV from edge to edge, lined up the patterns, and marked the molding. You can hand saw the 45 degree corners with a miter block, but a chop saw is much faster. We wanted to make sure the pattern of the molding matched in the corners, so we lined up the pattern and marked the cut line. Once we had all four sides cut, we added wood glue to both sides of the corners and lined them up to secure with a few staples. Once the corners were secured, we used some blue tape to hold the edges together while they dried overnight. We wanted to add a gold finish to the frame, so we used our favorite gold spray paint making sure to apply in thin coats. I used a mixture of brown acrylic paints and a dry brush to give the frame an aged antique look. We're going to attach the frame to the TV using some corner molding at the top and the bottom. Most TVs have sensors at the bottom. You may need to use two pieces and leave a gap in the middle. Next, we use removable command strips so that we positioned on the corner molding and the edge of the TV. Now it's time to hang the frame on the TV and test our handiwork. We're really excited about how this came out and it's the first thing that everyone comments on when they come over. Would you guys be interested in a longer tutorial?